Hi everyone, it is Patrice from Teresa's Crafty Life. In today's video, I'm gonna share part two of the handmade Valentine's embellishments that I've been making this year. I hope that you're feeling inspired by my videos to craft Valentine's Day. So let's go ahead and jump in. Here is a wagon that I made, and this wagon is by Hero Arts. It's usually used for the fall. However, I thought it would be fun to add some hearts. The hearts are from Hobby Lobby, and then I have this white shimmer paper, and that is from Sizzix, and I'll leave all the links down below. And here on the right-hand side, I went ahead and I added some charms. So I thought it would be cute to um, have this wagon in white and in teal. And I made another one too. The X and O chipboard stickers is actually from the Dollar Tree. I used this sticker set here, and it's all the way at the bottom if you're interested in picking up the stickers. And in this wagon, I added red hearts to kind of give it some contrast. And I also added red rhinestones and the wheels and the handle is in gold. So I thought these are really cute and you can use this year round by adding different things into the actual wagon. Next, I'm gonna share these sequins containers. I actually decorated the very top of it. These containers are from the 99 cent store. Let me share the original packaging. Here are the containers in pink and in red. I just dumped out the bubbles, washed them out really good and let it air dry. And I picked this up last year. I'm not sure if they have it this year. I thought it would be fun to go ahead and add this embellishment here in gold uh, using the gold pen. So I grabbed my alpha beads because I have a lot of them and I wanted to ensure to try to use my stash this year in 2023. So I spelled out the word hugs and then I also wire wrap this bead right here in pink and white. And then I added a red heart charm to give it that extra touch. This sequence mix was gifted to me in a swap last year and it went perfect with this set of embellishments. Here is a red container that I decorated and I actually have some gold alpha beads in my stash and I spelled out love with the same red heart and then I wire wrapped this pink bow. For this container, I added a couple things. So here is a XO with a heart. I added this pom-pom charm. This is so cute. I added a gold charm at the bottom and then a pink heart at the top. And then the last thing that I did was add this light bulb heart charm. For this container, I spelled out the word babe, added this heart wire wrap dangle, and then added this Frappuccino cup. So these are the sequence containers that I made so far, and I hope to make some more soon. Next, I'm gonna share suitcases that I made into Valentine's Day theme. And this is from Coca Rosa Studio. I'll leave a link to the die set down below. And what I did for this suitcase is I added this XO in silver or holographic, added some pink and white flowers to the corner. I added this sentiment sweetheart here and I lined everything in pink metallic paper. So that is one of them that I made. And for this suitcase, I added gold XOXO. Um, and the O's are actually in a heart shape. I added this sentiment once in a lifetime and I added red foil paper to the wheels in the back and to the very top of this luggage. And here's a final one that I made. For this one, I actually added rhinestones to the wheels, added the a pink XOXO, and then these chipboard stickers to the very corner of the luggage. Now I'm gonna share some handmade tickets that I made. I used the Little Bee Paper Punch to create this. I bought the punch several years ago from Tuesday morning and it is out of stock. So I'll leave the name to it down below. It might be possible to find it maybe on Etsy or eBay or sites like that or Mercari, um, but it is sold out and I don't have a direct link to it. So usually tickets are made 
you know, when we decorate, it's usually made this way. So I actually turned it vertical and I crafted and created on it this way. So I used mini embellishments to decorate each one of the tickets. So I put Happy Valentine's Day with two hearts. I put a small um, ticket here and propped up 14 on foam. And then I added a heart, a tag, which is so cute. Look at the faux stitching here. And then the phrase forever. Here's the next one that I made. It's mostly the main squeeze collection. And then I use scrap paper to actually punch out each one of the tickets because I want to use my stash. This time around, I actually used my scrap papers first to make these embellishments. So I thought that this banner was the perfect size for this very, for the very top of the ticket. And then I added some bling. Here I added a tag that says I love you with main squeeze propped up on some foam. And then this glittered layer heart that has um, stitching down the middle. And this is the sticker set for that. It's from Recollections. And Monty the polka dot pinecone is actually selling these stickers too on her YouTube channel. So I'll go ahead and leave a link to that down below. On this part of the ticket, I went ahead and used this puffy sticker of a mailbox, added this posted stamp to the right of it, and then added this really cute pink and iridescent heart. Here's the next ticket and I added pom-poms to the bottom. These pom-poms are from Daiso. This heart right here is a oldie but a goodie from Hobby Lobby. I was actually looking at the packaging and it's from 2017 and I wish that they would have made more but I really wanted the layers to show of gold, pink, and teal. The sticker was already on the heart. However, I added this ephemera of the camera and true love. Added this ephemera, you and me equals always. Added this mason jar. And then this wood piece is from Hobby Lobby also. There was a whole bag of conversation hearts that I had. And I thought that this would be perfect to add to this ticket. Next, for this ticket, I went ahead and... I could have cut this off, but I decided to still decorate on it. So I added a black heart, an XOXO, and I just layered um, two hearts together with this sentiment of love. You'll always be mine. And then this ephemera piece right here is really cute. You'll see a man and a woman. I guess they were like dancing together. Um, so I thought that this would be a nice touch to this ticket. This is all the embellishments that I made for this video. Let me know which one is your favorite embellishment so far. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, bye.